Hi everyone, I'm Professor Tash. And I'm Professor Jen, and this is with the Public Library's Halloween Potions class. <laughs> In this class, we're going to show you how to make the slimiest of potions. Um, if you've got a craft pack from the library, then you should have all the ingredients in front of you now. And if you don't have a craft pack, check out the comments section for all the ingredients you'll be needing and follow us along. So the first thing you'll need from your craft pack is your potion recipe. If you don't have one of these, that's also in the comments. So today I'm going to be making Veritaserum potion, which is a truth potion. Oh, and I have holy juice potion, which is transformation. And it's also going to be green, which is super cool. <laughs> the, uh, the other two potions that you might find that you have is Felix Felicis, which is a luck potion, and that's a beautiful sparkling gold. And I have the Wolf's Bane potion, which is Carmen and Blue. This is our main ingredient for the potion today, and it is the potion starter. It is actually PVA glue. This is what you'll be needing. Our second ingredient today is baking soda, which has magical properties and will cause a chemical reaction. Contact lens solution combined with baking soda creates borate. The final ingredient is unique to every potion. The polyjuice potion includes this frog sparkle, which was collected at midnight during a full moon. And now I'm gonna show you how to make your potion. I'm gonna be making the Veritaserum potion, which contains the Veritaserum Veritas sparkle, which was collected only by someone who spoke nothing but the truth for the last 30 days. And now to show you how to make the potion. To start making your potion, you need to take your jar with your PVA starter base, open the lid, and the first thing you're gonna add is your baking soda. So pour the baking soda into your PVA, take your stirring stick, and mix, 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 until it's all mixed nicely in there. The next step is to add your special ingredient. So we're gonna add the Veritaserum Sparkle. Now do this one carefully so you don't get glitter all over your table. So pour it all in, and just like before, mix it up as well as you can. So now you should have a jar filled with glue, some baking soda, and the sparkle that goes with your potion. Mix it all in and say the magic words, bubble, bubble, toil, and trouble. And now we're gonna do the really exciting part. Okay, so right now your potion is just gonna look like some big clumpy glue filled with sparkle. And this is where the magic happens. You're gonna take your contact lens solution and you're gonna add this really, really slowly. So when the contact lens solution mixes with the uh, baking soda, it causes a reaction called cross-linking, where the borat makes the glue molecules stick together. The more contact lens solution you add, the tighter they stick, and the tougher your slime is gonna be. The less you add, the gooier and ooier it's gonna be, but also the stickier it's gonna be. So you're gonna add in a little bit at a time and you're gonna mix and mix and mix. And can you see how it's all sticking together now? Okay, so we'll just keep mixing until we get the consistency we want. I think we need a tiny bit more, what do you think? Once you've mixed it all into your liking, and you've put as much contact line solution as you want, you should end up where it's pulling away from the walls like this and sticking to your stick. So pull it all out, pull it off your stirring stick, and there you have some stretchy, oozy slime. Now, if your slime is a little bit too sticky and it's sticking to your hands, you can add a little bit more of your contact lens solution. If it's feeling good and you like the way it is, you can just keep it as is. Just keep kneading it all together to make sure everything's all mixed in nicely. Um, for stretchier slime, you can add one or two tablespoons of water 
and you'll get a nice oozy stretchy stretchiness to it and that is our halloween potion slime let me know what you think in the comments and keep following with the library for more fun craft ideas and that's it for our potions class today thanks so much for joining me professor jen and professor tash and happy, happy halloween, halloween from whistle public, public library, library.